In the heart of a village named Ogbe, there lived a man named Agu. Agu was known far and wide for his insatiable appetite. His love for food knew no bounds. Agu would eat anything that crosses his path. Agu's round belly preceded him wherever he went. His neighbors would chuckle as they watched him walk down the narrow lanes. But Agu did not care. His only mission was to sample every delicacy the villagers had to offer. One day, as rain drenched the village, Agu's hunger intensified. He craved for something extraordinary. A dish that would satisfy not just his stomach, but also his soul. So he set off on a culinary adventure. His first stop was at Adama's Isiewu joint. Adama was known for her spicy, delicious Isiewu. He ordered for a plate and he finished everything in few minutes. He also went to the plantain and pepper soup joint. He ordered for a plate and he finished it immediately. Next, he went to Adamu Suya stand and he ate some sticks of suya. He also visited Iabisi's joint and he ate some more, but he wasn't satisfied. Word spread quickly and the villagers gossiped. People watched as he moved from joint to joint, eating devouring everything in sight. The village children followed him and placed a bet on how many plates he could finish. As Agu continued with his gluttonous adventure, he saw an ancient tree. The tree seemed to beckon him. As Agu moved closer, the tree asked him to make a wish. And Agu quickly said, Grant me the most delicious meal that will fill my heart and soul. And suddenly, a feast appeared before him. Agu's eyes widened as he ate. The more he chewed, the more the food kept multiplying. Agu could not eat anymore. His eyes swelled up in tears and he quickly ran home. From that day, he vowed to appreciate food. Agu started eating everything in moderation. He also started eating fruits and he discovered that moderation brought more joy than gluttony ever could. From then on, Agu became known in the village as the man who found contentment in simplicity.